what it do? I ain't see y'all in a minute, but your girl is back. I'm feeling better. The last two vlogs, I was just like, you no, know, I was in a little funk. I was just going through something, but you know, your girl is back, and I'm back to buy. What's up? <laughs> so we about to go to the movies, me and Shay. I gotta hurry up because it's six. 51 and the movie started at 7 15. Everybody gonna go to the movies to go see the Renaissance. So, I personally did not want to go see it. I didn't want to go on the Renaissance tour so everybody started like really posting about it. And I was like, maybe you should go, Kevin. Maybe you should go have a grand old time and just, you know, go from there. But I decided not to go last minute. But then when I was wanting to go, I had, I was able to buy tickets, but I want them having to work. So, we didn't get to go, me and Shay. So, that was that. So, I was like, you know what? Why not? So I was not gonna go see the movie either because I was like, you know, it's a movie like it's gonna be just about her, the whole thing. But I was as I was watching like people like post clips on TikTok and stuff like that, I was like, you know what? It might actually be pretty good. Not even that, but I wanted to go for a motivational purpose to see, you know, she's a black woman, you know what I'm saying? She's a black woman in the music industry and all of that, but she's a black woman in this world, and that's already enough for herself. So I just wanted to, you know, just like support and just see, you know, the crap she did, she made because the little clips I was seeing, it was very motivational. So I'm like, you know what? Let's go see it. Let's go pay the money because it's not, it's not the original price of a regular ticket. It's actually more expensive, but let's go. So me and Shay finna hit that now. Yeah, I got on this little um, a Walmart. It's like a little Walmart set, a jogger set, and um, my Fashion Nova puffer vest, and you know my Lord, my Lord vase. Larvae's and um, I don't want to do anything after that. I, I know if for sure I'm trying not to spend no money because I like to. So, oh, I didn't tell y'all earlier, I'm gonna get y'all the whole spill about that because this morning I have you know, I was talking but not recording, and I was like, this is some good gems I could be dropping on my channel, but it's cool, y'all. So, with that being said, um, I'm gonna come back. So, if we go if we don't go anywhere after the fact, I'm gonna come back here and fill some content. Shay's we want a dream con next year, so Shay's gonna get the tickets for dream con. So with that being said, I'm um they drop at seven o'clock and it's about to be five five minutes from there. So I I gotta see where she at, make sure she know everything's taken care of. But let's go ahead and head out. car hopefully that car stay right where they at <laughs> it was perfect lighting for me but y'all the mo i'm on <laughs> i was tearing that popcorn up y'all they got the flaming hot and like the cheesy popcorn up in there i be tearing that popcorn up that is the best popcorn i've ever had before like i, if I always had that we always eat that <sighs> I don't know if y'all had saw me in that movie, but I was in there crying. Like, I'm so happy. Shay did not come. Shay was trying to get the Dream Con tickets, so she didn't make it. But I'm so happy I still came because I needed that message. I needed that experience. I needed everything. And I'm just so happy. Like, oh, I'm probably going to go home and cry because it's just like, oh, y'all, that was just so. I can't take myself serious with these fingers like this. Like, the underlying message of the, of the movie was great. Like, 10 out of 10 Beyonce girl like ugh, 10 out of 10 20 out of 10 girl because I want to watch it again and I just want to when I'm having a bad day or a down day I want to watch it and be able to reflect on you know what she said and what she was relating to because that stuff was just hitting the right spot like I was in there holding back tears for the longest until like I think it was the show from her birthday when Diana, Diana Ross came out when she was like singing to her I, I could just see how expressed like how happy she was and surprised she was I started crying I was like just see somebody that was just happy living in the moment it just was like Man, I'm gonna go ahead and just head home because I need to just go ahead and just get myself together because I've just been like going. I have been in a funk, but it's just more so like stress wise because I'm trying to move. I'm trying to see what you know what God has in, in store for me. So, with that being said, I'm gonna figure it out. I'm sorry. Run it back. God gonna figure it out for me, and I'm trusting Him in the process that He will figure. You know, whatever's for me is for me, and that's what it's gonna be. I don't like really expressing my how I feel or just like where I'm at because I feel like. Everybody can be sometimes and very insensitive about what's going on. You know, somebody else, like, when I be going through like the stuff I be going through, they be like, "Girl, that's like that's just something small compared to what I got going on." Like you know, here my my roof of my house then caved in, or I understand where you're coming from, and I understand like you you know you're of different age, but it's like at the end of the day, I have never, I've never been 25 before. I've never been 23 before, so it's like this is new to me. Like you, know, like granted, I went through like the friend phase, the friendship phase, all the way back in high school, like freshman year in college. But 
you know, that's for me. So when somebody else comes to me, they be like, yeah, girl, you know, I'm I'm sad. I'm hurt because such and such ain't talking to me no more. I'm not going to be like, girl, you worry about somebody talking to you. I know. I'm going to, you know, take what it is in that moment, whatever, how they feel. I'm going to listen to them what they got to say and give them advice. Because at the end of the day, I know how it feels to be in that, in that predicament and, you know, and lean on, somebody, lean on somebody else for advice and they don't give it to you. So that's my biggest thing, my biggest issue. So that's what I'd be like trying to like, you know, thanking God that I go through stuff sometimes because I'm able to give advice. And I don't know everything. I ain't God, but sometimes I give advice. But I love you and I'll see y'all later. I don't need you hear me talk to the camera and you laughing at me. What are you talking about? What are you hearing? Sure, because I talk to my camera. I talk to all my people. Ain't that right, y'all? Yeah. I mean, I feel like at least you're not laughing at you. Like, you know, you know, you know, behind your back. <laughs> yeah. Laugh now, you be like, girl, record this. Record this. I'm like, y'all, record me. Well, get this on camera. Uh -huh. I always. I'm going to find so when I find my um computer charger that somebody stole. Oh, you got that computer charger that you lost that you keep on talking on here, right? No, I ain't lose shit. It's okay. <laughs> I didn't lose anything. I'm very responsible. Do so you think that any time that I lost anything, I don't lose nothing. I'm very responsible. So please don't falsely accuse me of anything that I did not do. You, you pay me all people who lie on you and wish on your downfall. Like this. No, 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 not what you're talking about. Well, now you don't know, but you know last week, but now you don't know. You don't know. Girl, release me all the shackles from this call. Huh? Release me from the shackles of this phone call. Why would I do such a thing? I'm trying to make content so I can get out the hood. Content. Out the hood. What is this hood you talking about? The hood you belong in. Girl, bye. bye. Hello. You know, you know, talky talky. No, I'm about to work. Just a do do do. Let me put y'all up. Trying to find a good spot so y'all can see what's going on. But I don't want to. I don't want to like mount y'all down just yet because I um want to show y'all my vision board. That being said, so this is my vision board, y'all, for last year. I just want to share this with y'all and so y'all can see. So I framed it as you can see. Let me turn the ring light. Well, I need the ring light. I'm sorry, y'all. It's I wasn't prepared. So this is the one from last year. As you can see, I did most of it, most of the stuff on here. But I want to just like go through it with y'all a little bit. So I always put my friends on my friend on here because me and her are inseparable. And I want to keep it that way. So I always pray about her. Just you know, make sure she's straight because we literally I that's a blessing from God. Shay is a blessing from God. So I want to make sure I you know I continue to be there for my friend. Just yeah. So I love this actually. I'm mad I don't have this. This is so cute. I guess like a like paper bell dub, whatever like that. But so I manifested it. So me and Shay was doing this little event. We didn't get to do it because my job came like my job and breaking me like non-stop so this fell through which is the back to school boogie but we'll talk more about that later so this is the non-profit man Shay started called the village so we'll talk about that more so you know down the line too so actually this is the side i'm more happy about y'all so let me get that glare up out of here let me just at least put it up i could just put it up and just turn it up there you go is that better no um is that a little better sir but so I got my camera this year, and which is I got the Sony's even. I didn't, I'm so happy I didn't get the Canon. I just, I didn't want the Canon. Like as I was doing my research, I realized I didn't want the Canon. I wanted the Sony GC. GC I mean ZV ZV one. I'm looking for the box. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start to pack it up. But I got the Sony ZV one. You see, I put myself on there. Manifestation, y'all. I don't know who picture this is, but I took it off of Pinterest and I used it put my face on there. That's me, y'all. Look at me. But um, I didn't get the computer this year, which is okay. So I'm gonna shoot for it next year. So I was debating about getting the um the MacBook versus getting the actual PC, or not PC, but the Mac. But I realized a lot of people having problems with their MacBook, and I was just like, I mean, it is great for travel reasons, but I also have my iPad. And so it's like at the end of the day, if I can't do it on my iPad, it just won't get done. I had put the pink iPad on here, so I had the old, I had an old iPad. I bought from my sister like when I was in college. 
But I wanted up. It was just not enough storage. It only had like 64 gigabytes on there, and it was just not enough. So I went ahead and bought me a new one, which is the pink iPad, y'all. I got the pink iPad. I'm so happy. Like, love it. Got the pencil. Love it. I was just too in love with it. And I got this little composition thing I decorated. Yeah, so. So this is my little thing about God. So what I don't like about this is that I didn't give enough glory to God on this one. I got this and I got that. I, I'm, this year I want to go more hard for God. Like, put more more quotes and, like, scriptures on there for him because I need to worship him. So, and this definitely, mental health matters, baby. Y'all won't get into that. But my business... Then we're going to talk more about sooner or later. Earlier, I went on a whole spill about how I had wanted to have a savings account. So, I'm going to be real with you. This year, I was not smart with my money. Like, I was, from the beginning of the year, um, so I started getting forced a lot of towards, like, the beginning of the year. So, when that happened, I was, like, my mental health was just steadily trending downwards. So, when that happened, I started finding, some, like, outlets. And my biggest outlet, which was not a good one, but it got me through, was shopping. So, my when i had extra money i was oh yeah i'm gonna buy these clothes let me go to fashion i was baby fashion over got was my best friend this year and some of them clothes that got tags and they ain't never been worn yet because it just was like in a moment like it made me feel good to even have it in my closet so i listened to this this sermon last night he was talking about like you know like we always beat ourselves down and just like dwell on it and he was like okay you didn't do it okay now that you know you didn't do it and you should have did it do it now don't dwell on it. Don't be on there like, man, I should have saved. I ain't saved all this shit. Now I'm in a hole. Okay, you, you recognize. Take accountability, take accountability for it. I missed that word all the way up, but y'all. Take accountability for it and move for it. Like, that's been my biggest thing. So now I'm like, no way, girl. Stay your money. Like, now we're predicting we're trying to move. We're trying to make, you know, make, make move off of faith. So, baby, stay your money. This year, I want to build my checking account. My savings account. I want to have an actual savings account. My goal is to have an account where I um open at another bank. Don't get a card for it. Just like totally put money in that bank in the um account. Don't ever check the like. Don't check nothing on that account. I mean, I can check every now and then make sure the, the numbers are adding up. Other than that, I want to keep putting money into money to stack up because when I don't see it, I forget about it. Not only that, but I'm a person. When that money be in my bank account, I'm assuming that's my money. That's money. Once my bills are paid, that's my money. That's my that's my money. So I wasn't being smart and saving. So that's my biggest thing. Fall back from this year is not saving my money. So yeah, it's all laid back chips. So, with that being said, we're finna get into the new vision board. We already started on our vision boards the other day with Shay and Celine, but I was just not in a good space. Like I was having stuff going on that day in my mind. Like I was in my head bad that day. So I didn't get to finish my own vision board. They all finished theirs, but I didn't get to finish mine. So it's, I feel like this is a perfect time now that I have, you know, I want to send a renaissance, y'all. And as y'all seen, I want to send a renaissance. And I'm so happy I did because that really was like, it made me be overwhelmed with emotions. I needed to feel it because I feel like lately I've just been like just... Trying to figure stuff out, just trying to, you know, like, just trying to, I don't know. It's so chaotic. I need to start writing stuff down because I've been forgetting. i just been, like, all over the place. And I don't like, I'm a person of structure. So when I feel like I'm just all over the place, it's not for me. I really, I'm going to push out on this, um, why is it doing it? I know it's me, but it's like, I barely tap it in it. There you go. I know y'all had a weird angle. Maybe I should just put y'all on. I don't want to keep taking y'all up and down for the um, ring light because I can't find my tripod for the 16th time in the century. But wherever it's at, it's gonna be there. So I'm just gonna have just pop it up on top of the um top of the ring light. So if it's better for me, but the light is better and all that. So we all could be two big one big happy family. So there's that. Yeah. Why when I put this camera on on the ring light, it's just died. I say you know what? It's just too much for me. So I'll be using pictures that y'all see for my vision board and. They did not, they stuck for that night. When I put this in my car, it did not last. So this is where it looked like now. Oh, and look at it, still falling off. This is what I have so far for 2K14. I drew this, y'all. But as you see, it's coming up as well. So it didn't very much get on. My favorite thing to do now is packaging tape. So what I do is when I go on here to place my, I go here and brainstorm first. Once I brainstorm, then I go ahead and tape it down. And that's when the, the real process starts. Mm -hmm. 
and everything to get no fasting. I don't care how much you knew me in the past tense. I ain't no joke and style, this ain't no last dance. Way past it. Wait. Get on my ex, cause he validate me. You never check, I don't want no receipt. I ain't get possessed, let my spirit speak freely. Hey. My past can't escape me. My pussy precedes me. Why am I all the time change? I'm still playing the victim, and you still playing the pick me. It's so embarrassing. All of the things I need living inside of me. finish my vision board i'm kind of indecisive okay about adding a job to it so i, I did want to as you know this lighting is okay as you know as y'all know i'm in a, the process of looking for a new job yes that is given so with that being said i don't know if i want to i haven't like figured out my job just yet what i want to do but i know i don't want to do shift work as in like working a 12 hour shift no more so that's that's a done deal because it just takes up too much of my time before y'all give y'all opinion and be like, oh my God, it's so much on there. I'm a person, I'm a visual person. I always have been a visual person. I'm a visual learner. I have to see it. Oh, you could put all the words on here that you want. If I don't see it, I, it's just like a picture resonates. Like a picture gives me like a vision. So it's like, I'd rather go in here with pictures than some words because I could be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get that house. And it stays right there. Like, let me see. That's why I visually, that's why I went on here and printed pictures of like, y'all, this lighting is just like, not on my side, but. So, that's why I went and printed like pictures of apartments that I can like visualize like this a new bed set. Sorry about that background, y'all. And it's like the how I want my kitchen to be like, y'all can't really see nothing. Like, oh, y'all can see, okay. I want my kitchen to be like that, like more spacious and just like, all that so right here details i want a waterfall 
I was in my next apartment. Not only that, but I want a spacious living room. So that's why I got the little, you know, the keys in the living room area. Then this is the living room area. I want to decorate. I want it to feel very cozy and comfy. So I want my room to be decorated a certain way. I gotta see if I don't see it, that's when it becomes a problem. And I saw getting unmotivated and everything else. So like, I'm gonna show y'all again all slow so y'all can really see everything. So yeah, I'm probably not gonna do much talking. If I do do talking, I probably insert like a voiceover or something like that because I don't know what y'all want me to say. You know what I'm saying? So just take it in. I'm gonna put some music on so y'all can just like feel it, get the vibes, and just go from there. seven in the morning and i'm about to call it a night like i'm actually kind of sleepy that's why i went ahead and just finish this vision board so i can go ahead and just be done with it i'm just so happy to see what the new year has to offer like i'm so happy i have a clear head now to just come back and do my vision board because baby when i tell y'all the struggle has been real for your girl lately so i'm just so happy about it i love it i love it before I be like, why you put that? Why you just didn't print the 2K14, 24? Why do I keep saying 2K24? I mean, 14. Before you be like, why you didn't print that? The underlying reason I wanted to put that in green was because I want a green to stand for it's go time. 28, no, 22 by 28 inches. As long as I find that, we can frame it. So if I can't find it, that's when I'm going to be in trouble. I'm about to go look on Amazon right now and find a frame for a cute frame. Because I'm telling y'all, wherever I go this year, this poster is going with me. They're going to be like, girl, where you? Like, whoever house I'm at, this poster is going with me. Because this, baby, this is motivation. I need to see it. I can't put it in storage. It's coming with me. Wherever I go, it's going with me, y'all. We're on this journey together, y'all. So those who, you know, y'all loyal, who be here from the start, y'all going to know what it is. Y'all seen last year's. And this is this year. So last year, I did so good. Like, man... I'm going to keep putting this desktop on here till I get it. This MacBook, well, Mac, this going to this gonna be on here, y'all. It's going to be on here till I get it. So, if, if I don't get it this year, prepare to see this picture one more time next year. Like, I'm going to get my desktop. Like, I'm going to get it. Look at my family, y'all. 
I'm just so excited I got up and did this. So I love y'all and I will see y'all later. Girl, stop trying to live in a world for everybody else. Like, be yourself. And everybody missed that whole entire headline. Yeah. Cause I, I, I put it, I tell Ducky, we got it. <laughs> I tell them that we can come to this room and we are family right here. Right. We, we can come to this bitch and as long as you don't bring no drugs in this bitch, we don't, we don't judge you, we don't get shit. We just have specific rules. Smoke your ass out. Yeah. In the teeth. Come in this bitch with respect. Oh, who's doing them down secret? Come in this bitch with respect. I I don't, you like, don't you light a nail number. Look, I saw. Uh huh. Wait, so run his pockets right now. What? Rob him real quick. Get his pockets. Take your head to go bust a wild open. I see he had enough with a Man, so y'all, I had love, as y'all can see, I didn't even get, get, get I didn't even get the time to give y'all even an intro. My bitch, I didn't even tell y'all like I was going to my cousin's house. Y'all, I didn't go to bed till late this morning because for one, when I finally had went to sleep, I woke up because my nose was bleeding. So I've been having nose bleeds the last few days. So y'all might see me later pull up, um, pull out the humidifier because they said the air just too dry for my nose. I have severe allergies. Like I deal with sinuses year round. That's me. So I guess the air has been too dry for me to like maintain the moisture in my nose. Now I just love it because I know I have a lot to do today. I gotta, for one, I gotta do makeup today. I gotta go praise the Lord. Thank you Jesus for a life that I'm grateful for. All that. Then I gotta go to this baby shower. There's that. So we finna get in this closet and find something to put on for tomorrow. So y'all, my, my, my sister said, I like somebody's grandma. Long as she rich, I don't care. <laughs> we just leaving the baby shower. It probably started at two, but it didn't start at three o'clock because you know, we're on CP time. If you don't know what that mean, look it up. I'm about to head home because I'm actually tired. It was nice, I'm glad I came, but by the time, you know, everybody got here, I'm ready, no, I'm, I'm ready to go. But I'm, I'm just tired. I'm sleepy. I need to use the bathroom and all of the above. And by the way, I didn't, I didn't get to tell y'all, talk to y'all earlier because my battery on my camera was dead. Yeah, church was so good today. Church was like great today. And I was just so happy I went because, girl, I was it locked in that message. Like, I was like just staring. Like, cause it was just like, it was hidden. And I was just like, man, she ain't speaking. She ain't talking that talk. I didn't do any makeup today because um, her... Her um boyfriend wound up surprising her getting her makeup done. So I mean, I was happy about that because I really didn't feel like doing it. Ooh, come on! The good is stuck in place. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. Bye. Yeah. Hey, y'all. So I just got back home. It is Monday. 
so today I I got, I dreaded to get up. I was so tired. I don't know why I'm so tired, y'all. Yes, I'm in the bed. I got on my onesie, so don't be looking all in mine. You know what I'm saying? But y'all, so I went looking for storages today. How did I know storages were that high? Like, if you want a good size, you're gonna pay a good penny. And I feel like so everybody pricing is different and i realized it's upon the area so i was trying to get a storage closer to this side of the way when i got a u-haul it wouldn't be so many miles on the u-haul but the prices over here are ridiculous versus back more in my hometown so i guess i'm just gonna hang it in my hometown just bite the bullet and just pay you know all the extra stuff because even even if i pay the the one-time fee and all that at at the um newer storage, well, at the one close to my mama, I still would come out cheaper than paying the storage fees on this side. And I was just like, I did not want to pay for that U-Haul and all those miles on the truck. But I'm going to just go ahead and suck it up. Oh, I got to show y'all my budget and bonnet I just got, y'all. It's, it's actually not dark outside. It's just, it's 5.33. So it looks dark. I'm gonna look, I just asked my partner to use my boots. I don't remember grabbing them boots. So I'll say, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, why the boots in my sack? <laughs> why the boots in my sack? Let me go tell you. Today, my budgeting binder came in, y'all. This is like a little pink marble binder with like gold tips on it. Starting 2024, we're gonna be we're gonna be smart with our money. And being smart means that we're going to be saving so i wanted to do it the right way in here we have like some some little tabs we got um money in yeah i'm so sleepy i don't feel like doing the extra going the extra mile setting y'all up on tripod and all that stuff so i did for my tripod it was in the kitchen the whole time i have sinky fun in here what is it personal care uh travel because you know you're gonna be traveling next year I have gas entertainment the savings the household car christmas the car payment insurance Y'all, look at the closet. Uh oh, I almost fell. Girl has been working all the time. Look at all the hangles. Look at all that. <sighs> so, 
over here is like coats. I decided to put like all the coats in one like bin or a bag because I didn't want to have to go through everything looking for a red coat or a blue jean jacket, all that. So I'm gonna put all my um coats in one little bin. That way it'll be easy access. Especially because it's winter time. I don't have to go. Then it also the the reason I don't want to put the coats in um the same bag, the same bin as the color because I have more like regular clothes than I have like you know jackets but the jackets are taking up so much room in the bin so i'd rather just go ahead and just like you know all it in one bin or a bag and just call it a day so i'm about to call it quits with this closet y'all because i'm actually sleepy and it's like two o'clock in the morning so i'm up early and continue and finish the closet so it's in the morning the mission is to finish all this and bring all this out this closet the way the closet be done and yep y'all I'm about to um go to my mama house. We don't know all the pajama and pizza party tonight. I hope they got pizza hoods. I don't want a, I don't want a little scissors. I want some pizza hoods. I just bought my sister a birthday cake. Cause what? Today's my sister's birthday. She will help every color's orange. So we got her some orange roses. I got on some other pajamas and my you know my little my signature headband. What's up guys? So, so, I feel like the people at my job been salty because I've been out so much, but y'all, y'all, ask me do I really give a f No, I don't. I actually don't. <laughs> Be mad. But the energy been weird since I, um, there you go. Y'all know they got the boxes in the background, but, um, I noticed everybody's energy be kind of weird since to me lately. And I know my, my job, they like, get very soft. Oh, I don't even know how that fell like that. Was it not up there good enough? Let me put something to hold it. Usually they stay up there. I don't know why it was bouncing around. I don't know. Let's zoom in a little bit. Not too much. Okay. But the people at my job, like, they be like, oh yeah, take a vacation, girl, get on vacation. Then when you're on vacation too long, you need to come back to work. Because, you know, because they know once a person, once somebody at my job go out, that means somebody else has to come to work. It ain't no like no one person just out you out. They make somebody else come to work. It's very unfortunate for those people who have to come to work. But, you know, me first. Like when they come their time, they do it. So what's the problem? I know there's like a shift in the atmosphere. We threw a party last night, a pajama party, and we also incorporated Kanisha's birthday in it so that was really good she had fun we all had fun actually like and then at one point my mama she had left out of the garage my mama she my mama i'm just she's very sometime whenever we put on certain music my mama we grew up my mama had us listen to like blues music so blues music is, blues music isn't very like vulgar as a, as far as like what they say but they do in same way like i know one dog my son i said my dog my song when she's all listening to was like my dog trying to your dog trying to kill my cat you know exactly what they mean i had put on this song last night if you're from, if you're from louisiana you just know the song it's called turn the beat up i put on that song last night the soon as she walked out of the um out of the room we was in i turned the song on and i tell you the whole garage it got crunk we was in the like crunk i said oh it's about to be a party in here tonight we had the cheering even like dance it was so nice 10 out of 10 we'll do it again i might go to roses i've been trying to like buy time because you can't sit at my mama's house like i told y'all you can't sit over here too long because she's gonna put you to work so i didn't came here like three times and each time i come here Something else pop up, so I was like, you know what, let me go somewhere else. So Monday, um, I had a little, you know, spiritual encounter in my sleep, and that scared the shit out of me. It didn't really scare me. It more so like I knew what was going on. Like I know the reason I was having a dream that I was having. Like immediately when I noticed the dream that I was in, I said, Oh Lord, I know what it's about to go. So I just went ahead and started praying, and you know, everything's okay. But I, that night, I was so afraid to go to sleep because. In a dream, I didn't let the dream reveal it to like what was going on. But I know I was like, I ain't trying to see 
nothing, you know, demonic in my dream. So I, I happily, um, you know, pray myself out of that. Then look at it. I, I saw it falling that time, y'all. I caught it that time.